Thank you, Mr. Joyce. Mr. Chairman, thank you for hosting this important markup and bringing this bill before the subcommittee today. Since 1993, technology and the use of the spectrum have evolved rapidly. During this time, for example, cell phones evolved from simple devices that made voice calls to sleek smartphones that put the internet in the palm of our hands. Despite these rapid advancements in technology, it's been 30 years since Congress reauthorized the NTIA, which is the steward of the federal spectrum and the chief advisor to the president on these issues. This reauthorization is long overdue, and I commend you, Mr. Chairman, for introducing this bill and moving it forward. In an effort to make sure the NTIA keeps up with the times, I introduced the Spectrum Coordination Act. This bill ensures the NTIA and the FCC are on the same page when it comes to spectrum actions and requires them to update their MOU on spectrum coordination every four years. This language will ensure the agencies work together and stay up to date with the rapidly evolving use of our nation's valuable spectrum. I thank you, Mr. Chairman, for recognizing the importance of sound coordination between the NTIA and the FCC by including my Spectrum Coordination Act in this reauthorization. I encourage all of my, legis encourage all of my colleagues to support this legislation. I yield back my remaining time to Mr. Curtis.